Hey there everybody, it's Peter from Indigo River Tiny Homes. We're here to show you our latest and greatest creation. It is an eight and a half foot wide by 36 foot long by 13 and a half foot tall road legal bunkhouse deluxe tiny house. And this was a custom build for a customer. I'm going to show you all the cool features it has. Starting with the exterior here, this is our standard exterior siding with the vinyl, white vinyl windows. But this is built with structural insulated panels, which gives it additional structural strength and lightens the load a little bit on the, uh, on the trailer. So it makes the house weigh a little bit less. We've got an exterior water spigot here, so you can hook your water hose up to your house, directly to your house. We have an exterior storage shed here. It's got a few mechanicals in it, um, but it's got shelves and, and a lot of storage. It's about eight foot tall inside. So you have pl plenty of vertical room to store tall items and plenty of shelves to store uh, boxes and bins and things like that. All right. Then up uh, on the other end, up under the gooseneck is the uh, utilities. It's got the mini split system under there, the breaker box, the fresh water connection. We're not going to show you that. We're going to go ahead and go inside because it's 104 degrees out here today <laughs> in Dallas, Texas. So before I go in, I'll go ahead and show. So here's the interior of the house. I'm standing on the entryway landing. It's got the shoe cubbies down below. Uh, to the left here is the kitchen. We did a galley kitchen in this house. Uh, we've got a full bank of drawers, our, cut, our standard sink with the uh, drop-in accessories. The, and we did, she did open shelving. Which is standard. Which is standard, yeah. This house has the most standard features yeah very Ratio few to <laughs> very few upgrades but the pantry there it's got the slide out pantry which is an upgrade here so the, the double slide out pantries We've got the slide out trash can here next to the sink this is our our standard fridge uh, normally we do stainless steel this customer wanted in white uh, standard two burner cooktop with a vent hood that's standard in, in all of our homes as well the washer dryer goes here next to the uh, next to the fridge, and it's going to be a stacked washer dryer. I was trying to turn some of these lights on. We didn't get all the lights turned on. Yeah, we've got some really beautiful fixtures. Yeah, she did a great job choosing the fixtures and the decor. This built-in bench here. Yeah. Uh, she's going to have a, a, a fold-up table here, and she's got some folding chairs as well. Some really cool folding chairs. Yeah, she got these recovered. Yeah. They're really pretty. They're antique. Uh, but there'll be a folding table here, so she, she has plenty of seating in her dining area. And of course, we've got the toe kick drawers. I'll show that real quick. We'll do this standard in all of our homes. We'll go through to the bathroom. So, first the laundry cove for a stackable washer dryer. Go there. And then she wanted the tub and shower combo. Full size soaking tub with a 14 inch soaking depth. And then, oops. So you do not hit your head on that. <laughs> cabinet even though it kind of looks like it from the photo we always get comments about that <laughs> <laughs> but no you it's don't back far enough and then she has a pretty vessel sink and a yeah. pretty light fixture in here yeah I don't Which know why that's not turning on did he oh he the, had to move it another yeah, minute the, ago the breaker's off for that and she's got hooks here Nice and spacious. And 
and go check out the downstairs bedroom before yeah. we oh we got our storage, storage stairs. stairs we got drawers with uh shelving not drawers doors with shelving inside standard wardrobe here so this is the bunkhouse bedroom design where you've got one bunk underneath and then that is the landing for the bunk above so that's a queen size pop-up storage bed is that correct yep. pop-up storage bed lots of storage underneath there so that was an upgrade but one of the few upgrades so this is going to be her master suite so this is a queen size bed yes Got the beautiful light fixtures here, and these even have little switches on them as well. So there's her sleeping space, okay. and then sitting room. Lots of windows, lots of light in here. There's the she got a little bit of a variation on the wardrobe with a. Yeah, so full length hanging on half of that wardrobe. And then it makes a nice little shelf there. Mm hmm. Nice shelf, and then you can hang short stuff all the way across the rest of the way. So this has got. We had three people up in here yes, or earlier today, and mm -hmm. there's plenty, plenty of space. Yeah. So this is a standard wall. The paint is an upgrade. The paint is an upgrade, yeah. That's one of her upgrades. The, <laughs> that was getting kind of loud. The, um, and then. The bench is an bench. upgrade. The bench was an upgrade. The, the pop-up storage bed, oh, the and pantries. I'll show the storage up here. I don't think that's about it. Some. Is that a piece of furniture? Yes, that's a piece of furniture that so um, she brought, it. and we, we just put it up there for her. And her water heater's up in that behind that little door. Yeah, behind that's, that door is a water we've heater. We've done that a couple times, but so yeah, yeah. that's it. This is there. It is. Lanai is the name of this model, and we built it for a customer, and we're delivering it tomorrow. No, day after tomorrow, and. She loves it already, she told us. Yeah. <laughs> and we hope you love it too. Thanks for tuning in, and we love you. All right? Y'all have a great Thanks day. Thanks for watching, everybody. Oh, click subscribe below. <laughs> <laughs>